What's up? You checking out the Frequent Flyer and we have this rather huge package here to unbox. We got the blue alien on deck. The box is so huge I'm going to have to remove it. So we have two things that were in the box. We have this one here. This is the H823H. And we have another one. This is the S5C. And this is from Snapton. Snapton. I think I'm pronouncing it right. Snapton. And so we have a mini size quad and we have a micro size quad. Or maybe this is a nano. Let's pop them both open. I think we're going to go with the nano first. Vision Beyond Imagination. Is their saying, I guess. So let's open this one up. Oh, so this is a nano. The H823H is a nano. So let's sit this back here. We have one more piece of documentation in there. We have a user's manual here. Looks like it's pretty legible. Here we have the little nano and I'm really liking the way this looks. I like the form factor. Looks really nice. Awesome little prop guards on here. <laughs> Non-removable prop guards here. So let's see, there's a light on the front there. Let's turn it on and see if we have any more lights. Just that blue light in the front. And looks like there's a light inside, but that's not gonna do us any good in a night flight. We have the transmitter here and we had something on the bottom of it. And this is an extra set of props. And we have a USB charging cable in here along with a screwdriver. Building up our collection on these screwdrivers. I really like these props here. Awesome looking little props. Anxious to try those on my teeny wop. Let's have a look at this again. I like it. Really liking the way this thing looks. The transmitter is not bad. So let's sit that to the side and let's pull this guy out. The S5C Vision Beyond Imagination from Snapton. We have an instructions manual here, a thicker, nicer instructions manual here. Oh, it looks like it's thick because it's in multiple languages, so not a whole lot, just many languages. So let's sit that back there. And this quad looks pretty familiar to me. I think I have a version of this quad without the camera, but this does come with a camera here. So, yeah, I think I have a white quad like this. Battery is inside already, but it's probably just not plugged in. And I was right, the battery wasn't plugged in. So let's try to plug this battery in real quick. And we're just, we're not going to turn it on right now. We're just going to stick that battery back in there. And we're going to get the rest of these things out of the box. So here's the quad. Looks like we need some landing gear on it. And landing gear is inside the box here. We have some prop guards, it looks like. A set of prop guards. We're gonna sit the prop guards back here. Transmitter comes on back there. There's an extra battery in the bag here. So we have an extra battery, we have extra props. We have a USB charging cable here. We also have some screws. I'm guessing for screwing down maybe the props or the prop guards. My guess is the props and the prop guards. Got that screwdriver in there. And it looks like we have some caps. These caps here for the propellers. Let's stick the legs on this thing so it won't be looking all lopsided. So the legs just pop on like this
There we go. And so let's get this transmitter all the way out of here. So this is the transmitter. An Xbox 360 style transmitter here. As far as the stick layout, it reminds me of the Xbox 360 from Microsoft. <laughs> we have one offset down here and we have one up here. We have this cross one here. Feels like they're just buttons and not a really a, a joystick or anything. Not a control stick. We, looks like we have buttons here for auto takeoff and landing. This one, I'm not sure. Can't make that symbol out. This one looks like it's the emergency stop button. This one must be to return to home or fly back or fly backwards down the heading is usually what they do. We have an on and off switch here. Let's see, is there anything else? Okay, this is a Wi-Fi FPV using a smartphone. You can pop the smartphone in here and do some Wi-Fi FPV. Three triple A's, the flip button it looks like. This one looks like the rates over this side. The joysticks don't press in, so you can't press them down. So really nice looker here. Both of them are really nice lookers. I like the whole black and blue scheme. So you guys can expect some flight footage of these coming up really soon. It's the Snaptain H823H. And we have the S5C. Thanks for watching.